Sediment transportation can leave us with amazing dunes and also barren lands. Weathering processes can uncover prehistoric features of this earth and reshape beautiful sceneries like batholiths along the way. Batholiths are large, intrusive, igneous rock formations. These plutonic rocks form from cool magma deep beneath the crust. Batholiths are primarily composed of felsic or intermediate rock types like granite, quartz, or diorite. Half Dome in Yosemite National Park, California, is a great example of a granite batholith. You can even see the exfoliating sheets on this close-up on the side of Half Dome. Wisconsin even has a batholith of its own. The Wolf River batholith is about 1,500 million years old, and it includes abundant quartz monzonite. Deep beneath the surface, batholiths sit under great pressure. With the removal of overlying sediment, this pressure is removed and the underlying batholith will begin to expand, releasing pressure. Being a strong rock, the batholith will not weather away quickly, but rather expand and crack off. This can be seen in an amazing way. And although occasions like this are rare, massive pressure releases happen occasionally. Watch a video of a man on top of a large batholith as it cracks releasing pressures that were once directly above. Did you see that? It just popped right up. I felt that one. Little, little piece flew into the air. Yeah, baby. Now it maybe you'll be happy. Everything is flat again. Those, those, all those pieces that were lifting just went back down.